Who's ready to cringe? I mean, the only people who won't be cringing are the people in relationships, probably. But I don't really need your love, just want your company. Hi, and welcome to my channel. I'm Allie Fitz, and I'm back with another video. And if you're new here, hello, I love you already. Make sure you slap that subscribe button to become part of the Fitz fam today. We pretty lit, it's true. And once you've done that, make sure to follow my social medias over here to stay connected with your girl. And turn on those post notifications so you know all the tea first. Speaking of tea, my song company is now available on Apple Music, iTunes, Spotify, and everything else that you listen to. So make sure to buy, stream, and download today. Because if we get company on the top 50 on the iTunes charts, I'm giving you guys episode back to back every single day. So make sure you're streaming. As a matter of fact, it's time for shout outs. Shout out to Kia Walton 07. Thank you for streaming company. You are my fave. We've also got Typical Zai. Did I say it right? Let me know in the comments. But thank you so much for streaming too. We've also got Cami Lel underscore. I'm, I'm butchering all usernames. But thank you for streaming. Love you. This is my favorite post. Okay. Izzel spams your screen. Look at her post. Okay. She's got coffee. Is that toast? And her caption says, I don't really need your love. Just want your cup of tea. I'm shaking. Like, those are better lyrics than company. T. And look, she's listening to Thanks for streaming, girl. You the best. And last but not least, we got Unicorn Queen 2.0. Thank you for streaming on Spotify. You the bomb, girl. But if you did not get a shout out in this video, it's okay. Keep streaming. Keep sending me screenshots because you might end up on my Instagram story or in my next YouTube video. Who knows? But now that that self promo is out of the way, okay. So y'all know it's Wednesday and you guys know the drill. I love doing different things on Wednesday. So my friends and I were talking like a couple days ago go about our relationship status and things that are going on relationship wise and all my female friends basically have boyfriends or guys that they're talking to and I don't which is no big deal I'm cool with it you know I'm a bad bitch you know some people scared to hit me up it's cool nope anyway yeah I haven't been in a real relationship in like 42,000 years because sometimes it's just like the thought of having a real relationship like a boyfriend cringe I just I don't know why maybe because I'm awkward I don't know like the morning text and the cute stuff you eventually send to your bae do we even say that word anymore see I don't know but if you don't know the cringe that I'm talking about because you're maybe in a relationship and don't realize don't worry by the end of this video you'll know the cringe that I'm talking about because today we're gonna be reacting to slightly cringy relationship quotes and stuff I don't really know what the title of this video is yet but I'm sure you see the title now and warning I may sound a little bitter in this video well because I am <laughs> Let's start. All right, so I'm on Google. I typed in cringy couple quotes because that's what we're looking for. So this first one though, besides chocolate, you're my favorite. Now, if my man ever sent this to me, block, because first of all, you're telling me that if chocolate was about to fall off a cliff and I was about to fall off a cliff, you couldn't choose which one to save. That's what you're telling me by this post. Uh-huh, okay, well, cringe. This one says, the brain is the most outstanding organ. It works 24 hours a day, 365 days a year from birth until you fall in love. Wait, until you fall in love? They trying to say when you fall in love, you turn stupid? Oh, so y'all the dumb ones. I am smart. Okay, got it. Look at this. Yes, I have a dirty mind and right now you're running through it naked. What? I plan on bugging you every single day for the foreseeable future. Okay, that's not cringy. That sounds like me. <laughs> You're the cheese to my macaroni. What are we, on MySpace? Oh my God. I wonder if y'all had a MySpace. Let me know in the comments below. Question of the day. Were you old enough to have a MySpace account? Anyways. Disrespectful. Do you hear him? I'm about to bring him in this video. Like he want to be in it so bad, sir. Anyway, you wanna know who I'm in love with? Read the first word again. You. Oh. <laughs> I am cringing. You wanna know who's cringing? Read the first word, I. Okay, but this. I wanna be the reason you look down at your phone and smile. Then walk into a pole. Okay, I didn't see the pole part. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> you love flowers, but you cut them. You love animals, but you eat them. You tell me you love me, so now I'm scared. Me? Okay, this is some tea. Oh, snap. I'm not even cringing. I'm like, well, get your cups. Because I would be scared too. Dang, this is deep. I know I'm a handful, but that's why you got two hands. <laughs> I got to send this to my friend Chad right quick. Hold on. This is something that me and Chad would say. Why are we cringy? We're not even in a relationship. Uh-uh, look at this long text message. Too long didn't read me. Just kidding, I'm gonna try to read this right quick and try not to cringe. I am so annoying. Love, ew. Maybe that's why I'm single. Oh my God, okay, anyways. I love you beautiful with all my heart. You mean the world to me. 
couldn't see myself with anyone more amazing than you. You're my best friend and the love of my... Oh, didn't even finish it. Okay, to this day, I couldn't imagine where I'd be if I didn't have you. Ew, I'm cringing. Like, like right now, this is my cringe. Just want you to know that you're my number one and I'm your biggest fan. You're beautiful, sweet, and funny, all wrapped into one. All cute. Love you, sweet pea. Sweet pea? With every bit if my heart. Mm, the typos. My reply would be the typos that he messed up. Ha, <laughs> cause I ain't shit. Okay, this is cringy, but this is also true. You never realize how much you like someone until you watch them like someone else. That's the tea. <sighs> Made me so mad. I'm like, wait, never mind. Wait, come back. <laughs> Women are meant to be loved, not to be understood. Um, wait, I'm meant to be understood and loved. What? Nah. Somebody get Oscar. Where is Oscar? Cause we gotta tell him that us women, we do wanna be understood. What you mean, Oscar Wilde? That awkward moment when you realize you're falling in love and all you can think is, oh crap. Is that really all you can think? Cause all I can think about is, will his parents like me? Can I really trust him? Is he texting Becca? That's what be going through my mind. See, y'all. The triangle relationship soon became a rectangle. Ow, that hurt my knee. If love is the answer, could you rephrase the question? Me. This isn't cringy, this is just me. You are the first and last thing on my mind each and every day. Uh-huh, yeah. Cause I'm sure you're thinking about me as soon as you wake up in the morning. Yeah, right, I'm thinking about breakfast. Bacon, yeah. I swear, these quotes. Oh my God, this. Babe? Yes, baby? I'm already done. Put your hands up. Don't shoot me. Give me a kiss then. Mwah, mwah. Oh, okay, how much do you love me? Are you kidding me? Do people actually text this? This has to be fake. <laughs> Ew. Guys, I cannot do this. He really typed blush, me. Do you think I'm a good BF? No. Why? Cause you're an amazing BF. <laughs> Y'all can tell that by these green texts, this is old. This is the like old stage of iPhones. And so maybe they were like 10 or 12, I don't know. Everybody was cringy at that age. How? Cause you always act like you and that's all I want, boo. Then he says, do I make you happy? Like he didn't already know the answer. Like what she just said clearly means that he makes her happy, but okay, you wanna ask the question? Go ahead, sir. She said 112%. <laughs> I'm out. I've seen this one before. I would rather get Ebola than receive this tea. My little baby, roar. You scared me, baby. I'm saying I love you and dinosaur. Get the. Y'all, but then, then there's the people who just be sending emojis, like these people, emoji, emoji, emoji. Like it's not even a conversation, how do you talk? You get to be home in a few hours, dinner's in the crock pot, yerp. So we can go fold laundry. Oh snap, okay, well never mind. Ooh, I do love folding laundry, me too. Oh wow, okay, well, they better go fold then. Read this. Hey, we need to talk. One sec, I just got a package. Great, I mean cool. Um, I don't want to be your boyfriend anymore. Oh, snap. Um, open the package. OMG, it's a diamond ring. It says, I don't want to be your boyfriend anymore. I want to be your husband. Marry me? Yes, I will. Okay, first of all, nah. If I opened the package, I would have been like, oh my God, this diamond ring is so cute, but you need to be over here so you can like bend down on your knee and you know, propose right. Yeah, that would have been me. Cause like, what you mean sending a package? I need you to be like this. Will you be my bad ass bitch? Oh, this is kind of cute, I guess. I miss everything about you. I love you. I love you from here to the moon. That's far. You're the best boyfriend in the world. You're the best girlfriend in the universe. Oh, he had to take it a step further and say the universe. Ew. Okay, that guy wants to fight. Okay, so I was looking for a specific picture to end with and it was this couple that was kissing on top of a road sign that was super high up in the air. Like it didn't make any sense for them to even get up on the road sign. I was like, how did y'all get up there? And I made a whole video about it, but I can't find the picture. But as I was searching for it, I found a lot of these people kissing in the middle of the road. Like, get out the street. What are you doing? I know it might look cute now, but it won't look cute if Bobby comes speeding down the road in his semi truck, I'm just saying. And they want to kiss in front of a sign that says falling rocks. Couldn't be me, couldn't be me. What you think the sign is there for? <laughs>
Yo, I can't do it no more. I can't, I can't do it. This, I know why I'm single now. All it took was that. I know why I'm single. But if you enjoyed this video and want me to like react to more things like this, I don't know. Make sure to give this video a big old like and share it with all your friends. Let everybody know about this tea. And don't forget to buy, stream, and download my song company. Let's get it back on the charts. I know we can do it, because it was on there before. Let's just get it back up on there. So have a great day in the name of the Lord. May God bless your every step.